I ordered a couple of wraps and some tea. <gasps> Bless you, I didn't have any breakfast this mm. morning. Nigel said that uh, Clint was up and out again before sunup. Mm. He had an early meeting at BE they had to prepare for. He's been working very hard. I read the article in the sun. You know, someday someone's going to run over Todd Manning, and you know what? I'm not going to be sorry. <laughs> How did Clint take it? Um, it didn't improve his mood. I remember when AC used to come home after dealing with the press, he was no fun to live with. Yes, well, Clint is nothing like Asa. Well, well. Mm. Gigi. Hi, Shane. How are Hi. you? Fine, thank you, man. Ooh, serious manners. <laughs> yeah, he's got his upside. Well, what you got there? Just something I drew. It's oh. a comic book. It's all made up. Can I see it? Let's see. Oh, wow. You're very good. Wow. Just like Eva Longoria, I know, I love her. Oh, I do too, and what a figure. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah, not enough cottage cheese in the world. Don't tell me about it. I gotta get Shane to school and then head back to work. Right. Will you bring that by when you're finished and show me? I will, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah. What a talented child he is. Listen, Renee, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to snap at you about Clint and Asa. You know how much I loved Asa. Asa was a wonderful man. Yes. But his methods were often... Not kosher. <laughs> and that article, um, Clint said, was not entirely inaccurate. You see, well, he... I think he feels that he should be running B.E. Enterprises in a manner that would make his father proud. And you're afraid he's going to turn into his father. I hope that doesn't offend you. I don't want it to offend you. No, 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 no. no. I wanted you to meet me for lunch because I know what it is to stand by a man when you don't necessarily agree with him. Well, I appreciate that. It's just that I, I, I can't support anyone who's doing something illegal. He may have to learn to live with it. I did. I mean, you said it. <laughs> this family's future is in Clint's hands, and he knows it, and there may come a time when he has to borrow from his father's playbook. And if you want this relationship to last, you may have to accept that. I'm not sure I can do that. Then you have to be ready to lose him. You know, I confess, when I first heard that the two of you had feelings for one another, I was a little uneasy. Why? For starters, I didn't think that you could love anyone the way you love Bo. And I knew what Clint and Vicky had had together. When I see you guys together now, I was so wrong. You make one another so happy. Yes, we do. Except in this one tiny little area. Mm. Understand. I think you're wonderful. I adore you. You know that, huh? Okay. Darling, love, if it's going to last, means compromise. Live and let live. And that's really all I have to say. Jamie, how was school? Good. That's good. How are you doing? Okay. Bye. Bye, sweetie. Come on.